G'day, welcome back to the 40 channel. So, Jack's here for a quick time before I've got to take him to work and we have to get started on this 40 because yes. we do not have much time really to get this whole thing built and ready for what? The drive for a drought. Long drive for a drought. All going well, Jack's gonna join us on the trip. Uh, comes down to your studies, doesn't it, at school? <laughs> but the first thing we're gonna do right now is might as well start with the doors. Let's do it. Okay. Undone all the bolts on the outside, but don't forget to do that little tiny uh, restrainer bolt. It's only a 10 mil nut. Alright, let's rip that yep. side. Get that other bolt. Yep. All right, strip this door down. We'll put it back onto the other door, then we'll be able to throw on basically new doors. Nice. Let's rip that inside. Right, okay, so we need the glass out of this door so we can put it into the doors that we were going to put in the FJ40 build that I did have on there for a little bit, but we weren't happy with them, so we stripped them off and we did doors for it. Now, the problem with this door is that some of the hardware is, is cactus. It's no good. We can't even wind the window down. So what are we going to use as a window winder, Jack? Vice grips. Nice. So clip that on there, mate. Start winding it down. I'll start unbolting all the hardware. Now the cool thing is, like I said, I've been able to collect a whole lot of stuff over the years uh, from other builds and people have bought stuff and I've bought stuff others. People have given me stuff, all sorts of stuff. So the cool thing is, we don't actually have to spend too much money on this build, otherwise mum would not be happy. No. And any money we do spend on it, we will say that Jack bought it and gave it to me. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> so the cool thing is, we've got uh, old genuine winders, there's nothing wrong with these, they're good clean up, they'll make a good replacement, we've got old lock mechanisms, we do have new Bailey channel, so brand new Bailey channel, that'll go into it, so at least that'll seal up and it won't leak, so that's from, that's from uh, RSA, I just bought it off their webpage, really cool. Uh, we've got felts. Now these ones came out of the FJ40. We've placed it with brand new genuines on the FJ40. And these ones are in good enough condition, or well and truly good enough condition, that we can put into this. So the door will be close to being brand new. All right, let's wind it down, Jack. Let's start stripping this all apart. Look at that. <laughs> the window is not even attached into the winder. Cool. Wind it all the way down, we'll push that so that way it makes it easier. So for some reason the window's not even in the winder at all. This door is really cactus. We're not going to go into detail on how to strip the door down because we already have a video for that. Check that video out. Now again, we're not going to go into super detail on how to tin a window because we've already done that as well. So if you check that video link out, you'll be able to jump over to there. So all Jack's going to do is spray down the glass with some soapy water. Very much, Jack. Now, 
Right, eh? We've got the door done. It's going to be a little bit tricky. We might hold it up there, Jack. Oh, no, let's sit down so the bolts can go in it. In line with it. Chuck a bolt in. Do you guys have teeth? No, just keep going, keep going, keep going. Right, eh? Now, Jack's just got back from work. Yes. I've just finished the door off. And look at that. Looks nice. And the cool thing is it's already a similar colour to the rest of the car. So we might, uh, yeah, a few options. Jack said he wanted to Raptor it. Maybe we just give a quick rub back for the time's sake because we don't have much time left just to get yeah. it on the road. Um, yeah. Anyway, we'll chuck the other door on. It's done too. We'll throw some mirrors on and then we can move on to something else on it. Nice. Good job, Jack. Well done. Right, eh? So the second door's on. Yep. There's the old one. Funnily enough, the, uh, the, the guy I bought this off said that I could possibly sell this door for like $800. If you're willing to pay $800 for this door, send me a text message. <laughs> now the big thing with these old cruiser doors is they all rust out down the bottom. This one had the same issues. And the reason for that is as soon as the felt start to wear out a little bit, a bit of rain on it as you can see, the rain runs straight down here, pulls at the bottom, if the little drains are blocked up, the water sits in there and rusts out. So it's very important you just clean out those little drain holes and do some type of really good rust preventative. So Jack's used some R88 from Chem Tools. It, it puts like a waxy film over it and it is incredible that stuff. I've tested it and I've got um, proof of uh, that being used for over two years and it still has not done any rust at all. I'll show you that what I'll show you the result of it because it's pretty amazing, isn't it, Jack? Yes, it is. Right, to finish off these doors on the outside, we've got brand new locks, new handles, all recycled hardware. But what do we need next? The mirrors. Mirrors. Right, eh? First now, mirror. these are non genuine mirrors. Um, I'm going to be honest, I did have them on the FJ40 just for a little bit until Shelly bought me some new genuine mirrors. So, FJ40 build, very genuine. This build, not so much. These non-genuine mirrors are very cheap. They'll do the job for what we needed to do, but yeah. Anyway, let's put them on. Tiny bit, only like a drop. That's it. Pop. There you go. Nice, just do up the screws and we're done. Righto Jack, that's the first part of this little project done. So, doors, new locks, mirrors, mirrors handles, secondhand hardware, new Bailey channel, secondhand felts, brand new rubbers. I'm really happy with that because it seals nicely. There's no more crazy rattle in the door, so that means that when we're driving down, we're not going to get a loud rattle. Well, there's going to be a lot of loud noises through these cars we're driving, but that's not going to be one of them. So, anyway, that's it, Jack. Good job. Awesome. All right. Well, guys, thanks for watching. Appreciate your support. And until next time. Thanks for watching.